Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you how to restore your black bumpers for free. Okay, here's a pretty typical example of an aged black bumper. It's starting to fade and go grey. What I'm going to be doing today is showing you how I put some life back into old bumpers such as this. Basically what I'm going to be doing is using heat to restore the black bumper. So for this to work, what I do is first start by gently heating the bumper before progressively working outwards from a single central spot. You can see as I start to focus on a small area, the bumper slowly changes from grey to black. Once this spot starts changing, I work outwards from there and as I do, the colour begins to spread. You'll notice that this particular car has rear parking sensors, so I'm very careful not to put too much heat into the sensor itself by focusing the heat gun for too long on that spot. The other major thing to look out for is not to put too much heat into the paint around the bumper. If you focus the heat gun on the paint too much, it will bubble up and it will burn. To avoid this, always be careful where the gun is pointing and don't focus the gun for too long on an area of bumper that is close to paint. Ultimately this just comes down to practice, although until you are practiced with it, just be really really careful of your paintwork. The reason this technique works is basically because when a bumper goes from black to grey, it's generally from years of exposure to UV rays from the sun. This basically opens up lots of pores in the surface of the bumper, making it look a lighter, greyer colour. Putting heat into the bumper essentially melts these pores back together, giving you a more solid and uniform dark black look. So technique here isn't the be all and end all, you will notice sometimes I work in straight lines, other times I work in circles, whatever works for you is best. So by looking at this test area you will see just using heat alone will give you quite a drastic transformation. Even with that being said, what I personally tend to do, once I've done the heat gun trick, I tend to put some bumper gel on there just to seal in this new finish. Of course this isn't necessary, you don't have to do it, the heat gun alone will do the trick. This is just something that I do to protect our newly restored bumpers. So just a reminder of where we started from and where we've ended up at. Quite the transformation, I'm sure you'll agree. Just so you've got a better idea of how the process works, in this shot I've tried to get a close up of how the bumper transforms under heat. You'll see that the as the bumper gets darker it spreads slowly as I move the gun around. This is that gradual melting process that I mentioned before, this is the pores melting together going from grey to black. I've got to reiterate at this stage, please be very careful of your paintwork, if you get too close to the paint with a heat gun it will damage it. Here you'll see how I deal with the edges of the black bumper and how I try to avoid burning the paint by gradually working to and fro the edge of the bumper slowly with the heat gun just until you see that spread of darkness and then come away again. Honestly, it's easier to do several passes than to go in too hard and burn your paint and wish you never had. So here I'm tackling the rest of the bumper. As you can see, this is quite a quick process. Obviously I've sped this footage up, but realistically it won't take you very long to do a black bumper with a proper heat gun. Now that is saying with a proper heat gun, as opposed to a hairdryer. Unless you've got a very, very powerful hairdryer, I doubt it'll have enough puff to do this job. So, if you've got a lot of black bumpers to sort out, it might be worth investing in a proper heat gun. Overall, this is a very worthwhile job. Uh, Grey, old, knackered bumpers can really ruin the look of a car. So whether you just want your own car to look a bit better, or if you want to improve the look of it for sale, this is definitely something you should look into. A fresh set of black bumpers make a car look 10 years younger. After all, this is a free and easy fix. Why wouldn't you give it a try? Right guys, thank you very much for watching this episode of 5 Minute Fixes. If you want to see more, please subscribe. Also, let me know down in the comments if there's any jobs in particular that you'd like to see me tackle, and I'll look into it. Cheers!